If you want to learn a Canva trick that I shared with a Canva verified expert that absolutely blew his mind, then you're going to want to watch today's tutorial. Instead of going to the Elements tab, you're going to slide down to the Apps section. We're going to talk about two different apps. The names of them are called Can Blob, which looks like this, and Can Squircle. I've got them over on the left hand panel. Basically, what you can do with Can Blob is create a blob. Now, you might think, how does this help me with YouTube? Oh, but it is. I have discovered a trick that I'm pretty sure no one else has shared. In fact, this trick made Darren Meredith go, wait, can you do that again? But before I tell you that, let me show you how this works. You choose your blob complexity. You can even choose your color, but I'm just going to tell you, don't even worry about that because the trick I've got to show you, the color does not matter. And you can generate it again and again and again and again until you find a shape that you really like. I'm going to go with four. This one looks good and I'm going to add it to my design and with the squircle, you can change the corner radius and you can change the corner smoothing. So I've just done this basic squircle shape. We're going to add this to the design. The first trick I'm going to show you, I'm just going to take a picture like this one and I'm just going to slide it in the can blob. This is what blew uh, Darren away. Not only is it a blob, it's actually considered a frame, a placeholder, because when I detach that image, it has turned into a placeholder. And that got me to thinking, if I can do that with images, can I do it with videos? I'm going to go here to my Uploads tab, and I'm going to go to Video, and I'm going to put in this video right here, which was actually part of a tutorial I did. And in that tutorial, I had myself in a rectangle shape in the corner. But with this, I could actually put myself into a fun shape in the corner instead. Canbox is the creator of the Can Blob and Can Squircle app within Canva. They also have some more additional tools that you can use within Canva. They've got Can Lorem, They've got Can Border, Can Grid, and Can Wave. These CanBox apps are absolutely free, but there's actually a fun way that you can use these apps if you have the paid plan. In order to see how I took this image like this and turned it into this, watch this tutorial that's on your screen right now. And I'll see you next time. Bye.